Types of radio. What are the different radios that have developed over the course of the last century? And how do they work as tools of communication and information transmission? So, learn more. Let's get started. Number 1. AM radio. AM radio stands for amplitude modulation, and it's one of the oldest types of wireless broadcasting. With AM radio, an audio signal works to alter the strength of radio waves. This process is known as modulation. The AM radio in your car or house then works to decode this modulation into a discernible sound that the human ear can pick up. Number 2. FM radio. Many people who listen to the radio in their car listen to FM radio. Developed in the 1930s, the FM radio comes with many enhancements that make it popular to this day. FM radios, or frequency modulation radios, put more focus on the modulation process that alters radio waves. This is in contrast with AM, which instead relies on the signal strength. Number 3. Shortwave radio. While AM radio has a frequency between 550 and 1720 kHz, shortwave radio is just about that, at around 1.7 to 30 MHz. Shortwave radio frequencies interact with the ionosphere in a special way. This allows shortwave radio broadcasts to travel hundreds and even thousands of miles. In some cases, people can tune into a broadcast from anywhere on the Earth. Number 4. Satellite Radio. Satellite radio is a newer form of radio broadcasting. It's commercial based, requires a subscription, and is powered by satellites. This allows satellite radio to cover huge areas without compromising audio quality. In contrast with AM and FM radio, satellite radio is encrypted, requiring you to have a special receiver. However, having the receiver is not enough to listen to it. Unless you pay for the subscription plan, a computer chip will prevent the receiver from accessing the satellite radio channels. Number 5. Ham radio. A ham radio, also known as amateur radio, operates on a special set of frequencies determined by the Federal Communication Commission. To use a ham radio, you need to have special equipment, a license, and training. Like shortwave radio, ham radio is able to broadcast signals thousands of miles away. This makes it an interesting hobby for many people, as they have the chance to interact with users in different countries while improving their broadcasting skills at the same time. Number 6. Walkie Talkie. Most people have played around with walkie talkies at some point in their lives, but few realize that they're also a type of radio. Just like the other types of radios, walkie talkies also transmit and receive radio signals. While convenient and fun in certain situations, walkie talkies generally have limited battery life. They also have a range of around a mile, making them impractical for long distance communication. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe our channel.